Ooh. Mm. Well, um, it looks like we're doing something a little different today. Hello everyone, my name is Danny, and if you didn't know this, I'm a British gentleman from the 1800s. And today, um, I'm going to do something I've never done before. I'm going to paint. But, we're going to be following one of the greatest men of all time to teach us how to paint. We're going to be learning from the wonderful and one and only Bob Ross. <laughs> Why is my house t making noises? Discord, shut the fuck up. What was I saying? We're gonna be painting Bob Ross today before I was so rudely interrupted. Um, I have no idea what I'm doing. I've never painted before in my life. I'm not... My house! I don't know what I'm doing. I don't think I'll ever know what I'm doing. Do we know what we're doing in this universe? But, uh, this is what I'm doing to distract myself from the inevitable demise of the human race in my life. So, uh, if you want to follow along with me, that's wonderful. Get out your canvas and we'll paint some happy little trees. I don't actually think we're painting trees today. So, uh, hopefully this goes well. Make sure to grab some food and water if you haven't gotten that already today. And, uh, are you happy? Can I help you? Are we really happy? I don't know. We're just distracting ourselves from the inevitable. Hopefully my house will shut up now and and uh, let's get to watching some Bob Ross. So first, obviously, we have to color the canvas in a liquid white, as he so nicely says. Bob Ross is wet on wet painting, so we have to, you know, cover it with paint and make it wet. This is zinc white. Can't untwist this, Jesus Christ. There we go, there we go, untwisted. There we go. I've never held this before. Hopefully I'm holding it right. Someone will tell me in the comments if I'm not. So first, we take the brush and we can get the white. Isn't that crazy? Even coat all over. I have to stream in a couple hours. Hopefully I can get this done in time. One of the bristles came off and it's sticking to the painting. Come on, shimmy sham. Out of there, we don't like you. This is a painting, not a haystack. All right, we're done with the white. We're gonna clean the brush. We're gonna stick it in my glass of water right here. Everyone say hi to Jeffrey. Jeffrey's a skull. So we're gonna, we're gonna stuff this in Jeffrey. Then I guess beat the devil out of it. There's definitely still just white paint on this brush. Now we actually get started with a tutorial instead of just covering the canvas in liquid white. So we're gonna start with a bit of a phthalo blue and we're going to um, work it out just a little bit once I can get this tube open. These were very graciously donated to me by a starving artist. I don't know why they did that. I'm going to ruin their paints, 100%. We're gonna take this and we're going to get a big bunch from the tube. We're going to just squeeze. Oh, it just exploded. Oh, this paint tube just busted a nut all over this. So Bob told me to take a little bit, drag it out just like this and uh, Tap the bristles, he said. We gotta work it out, he said, so I'm gonna try and do that. I feel like I'm using more space than I should, but it's fine. Is this how you paint? Who knows, I don't know. Art is relative. And then he told me to crisscross it across the top. So, um, I feel like I have too much paint on there. It's all right. I definitely don't think I did this right, but it's fine. Bob told me to go part of the way down, so uh, I guess we're going part of the way down. I feel like it should be blending more with the white, but I guess, nah, I guess I didn't put enough on. I'm, I'm a little stupid. This feels weird. I don't, I, don't, I don't know why, it just feels weird. Damn it, more bristles came off and my canvas is just moving off the easel. I feel like this definitely isn't just blended as it should be, but I, 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 I don't, I'm not good at this, okay? I'm getting a phone call. Hey guys, I'm making a video right now, what's up? All right, I think that's good. I think, no, nope, there's still in the corner, I need to fix that. It looks disgusting, like I put my grubby fingers all through it. Why is water dripping everywhere? Well, we're gonna wash the brush because Bob told us to add cobalt to the, uh, Thalo. All right, who wants the forbidden milk? We're going to smear the cobalt and the phthalo together to create a new color. Mix that in there, the dark and the light. And so now we're supposed to drag across the bottom and create water. This is terrible. I'm garbage at this. This is gonna look so bad. I'm not even kidding. This is gonna look disgusting. I definitely just didn't put down enough liquid white, which is a problem, but uh, that's a little late for that now. I did not notice I was getting it on the wall. It was never there. Okay. Now Bob is saying we need to add some Cadmium yellow. I don't exactly know where he wants it, but it's definitely not in the white space that I have. So uh, I guess we're just going to be mixing yellow in there. So we're going to get a nice puke green. This is why I don't paint. I'm a terrible painter. Baking, I'm good at that. Well, I don't know why I'm trying this. Just the tiniest bit of cadmium yellow. Boink. And apparently there's supposed to be um, some white in there in the water and stuff, but um, I'm stupid. I'm just going to... Uh, yeah! Oh, isn't that just lovely? That's beautiful, isn't it? Then I'm supposed to blend that in, which I wish I knew. 
So then I'm just gonna go like whoop, 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 whoop. Spread the egg yolk all over the painting. Now look what you've done. We have a puke ocean. This is beautiful. Bob Ross would be so proud of me. Bob, I can't do this. You're, you're lying to me. All right, next, Bob wants us to make a cloud. How do you expect me to do that, Bob? So I gotta get more white, apparently. I'm gonna put this brush down. Pull up the big one again. Ooh, spooky. And now we make happy little clouds. Bob, this is not what I wanted. You're fucking me, Bob. You're, you're fucking with me. Happy cloud. That's a cloud. Right, that's a cloud. This looks like this was done by a third grader. Apparently I have the mental capacity of a third grader as well. Happy cloud. That's totally a cloud, right? Don't you judge me. This is the first time I've done this. All right, then Bob told us to come and uh, blend the bottom. So we're going to do that. Just looks the same. Now it doesn't even look like a cloud. It's like it wasn't even there. There you go. No more cloud. Bob wants us to make more clouds. Stay all right, Bob. Well, let's try. God, I fuck it. This is why I don't paint. This towel I'm using as like a wet wipe looks better than that. All right, you want some more clouds, Bob? Let's get you some more fucking clouds. You like that, Bob? You like that? God, I hate this. There, happy little clouds, Bob. I hope you're happy, because I'm not. The clouds took my happiness, and so did you. All right, now we're gonna make a mountain. All right, Bob, let's make a mountain. Because Bob Ross ass, and that's why we do things around here. We make mountains. All right, well, our Lord and Savior and God Commander, apparently, Bob Ross has instructed us to mix brown, black, and blue, but not with a paintbrush, but with a knife. We're gonna, he said to go like right here, and we're gonna just make a mountain. All right, let's make a mountain. I'm sorry, Bob Ross is a magician. I am simply a peasant that knows nothing of magic. How does Bob Ross make a fucking mountain? I am smearing black paint all over this canvas. What the fuck? Bob's a lot more graceful at this than I am. Is this a mountain? I don't know, maybe. Art is interpretive. Mountain. Boom. In your face. Oh my god. Bob, you're crazy. There. Now we have some interpretive mountains. The reason why he said he went into painting is because he can create any world he wants. Well, Bob, that sounds like you have control issues. You know what? No. I'm done listening to you, Bob. I'm done feeding your issues. It just looks like black now, Bob. Doesn't look really cool anymore. I think Bob Ross tried to fuck me again. I had a little bit of white. We're gonna, we're gonna do some creative interpretation here. The white's gone. All right, didn't matter. Anyways, okay, cool. Cool. There is no room for creative direction in my life. Now we take some white and burnt Sierra and we're gonna mix those together. All right, that's actually not bad. That's not a bad mix. It's kind of what I need actually. Edge it just slightly. Edge it, yes. Not in a sexual way. Now he's telling us to like go down like this. Yeah, just like that, Bob. You like that? This, is this what you want for your mountains, Bob? Is this what you want? Do a little bit of this. Add some jazz to it. I refuse to bend to the whims of his fake reality he wants to create. Bob has issues, and I'm gonna be there for him in the way that he needs it. Tough love, and in my own artistic interpretation. It's canon, Bob Ross has control issues. There you go. If I told you this was art and tried to sell it to you for two million dollars, would you buy it for three million or four? Oh, we're supposed to spread it this way. Well, looks like I'm gonna need to grab this brush and just dab it in a little bit of this and just do a little bit of that, blah, blah, blah. There you go, and then we smear that way. There you go, thank you, Bob. Look, green thumb, ha <laughs> ha, funny. All right, let's combine the green and the yellow just as Bob has directed. Smack it on, right there. This is art. I call it the inner mind of Danny because it is a mess. I'm not going to lie, the knife is the fun part, so I'm just gonna screw green. We don't want green on our mountains. Deforestation is already killing all of our forests anyways. We don't want them in our paintings as well, don't we? At this point, I've said fuck Bob Ross. We're not listening to him anymore. I feel like I should do something for the water. I don't know what I'm gonna do for that, um, I guess. Let's take some, let's take some titanium white and you know, give it a good mix. I'll make like a good grain. We'll put it down here for the shawl. Oh, that actually is great. Damn it, I didn't mean to do that. I can't take this anymore. I want to kill someone, especially Bob Ross. So, uh, thanks for watching today. I hope you like my painting. It's going to be on auction for five million dollars. And if not, I will burn it or I will give it to someone to use. Um, again, thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this. I sure didn't. Uh, get some food and water if you haven't already, even though I told you to. I have a knife. See right here. I'll come and find you. And, uh, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day, darlings. So, uh, take care of yourselves. Love ya.